YouTube and today I'm going to be doing my 100 subscribe special with the Fauna 80k which I haven't done but I built a thing when I was season 5 which was probably one of my most favourite seasons and my custom avatar thing that you see on my, my channel logo thing right yeah but there's the Christmas hat somewhere on my desk, but it's very messy, so I can't find it. So, yeah, let's get into the tutorial. So, with um the cust my main minifigure, I have like two custom guns. This and the assault rifle and the pistol. I've got for the minifigure. I got the old um like twenty thirteen. I think it was like the clone like camo legs then I have the I think it's like 2012 or 11 you have, there's the rebel jumper thing and I haven't edited any of these like no switch the hands so it's all the same I used the Lego Lord of the Rings um uh I think it was Frodo's head yeah, when you got the spider bitten, there's the paralyzed face. I just used this one, and I've got Kai's hair from the Lego Ninjago series, which is quite nice. So then that, these are just custom guns that I got off eBay. So, yeah, that's the custom minifigure. Let's move on to the ATK. With the following builds, I'm just going to use, like, and just put it into chunks. Then I'm going to give you all the pieces so you can build those chunks. So starting with the back of the base, you got a pickaxe, a one by one clip with one by one, like, play it with a clip on the end. You got a two by two, no, a two, a two by one, I'm getting all these wrong. And then a one by one stud at the back. Then we have two one by eights. Yeah, that's a one by two one by eights. I'll make up most of the base. Got two one by two clips right here. Got lightsaber and a stud, as you can see on there. Got a two by two plate here, a two by three, and then a two by four in this arrangement. And you got the one by four plate right here. We've got a, a pair of clips on, of hinges. It's got two, one by two size. Then you got a one by two jumper plate, a one by two clip on the top like this. And you got one of these bars. So that'll attach on like so. This will fit on there. And then for the wheels, we have a a two by two round plate, then just attach this on, attach this on. So that is the base of the ATK. So moving on to the front, right here, we have a two by four, a two by two brick, a two by two one of these slope pieces, then you got two ones of these. I couldn't really find the pieces that fit the colour which these should have been white but yeah I'll try and prove on that later. So that's the front of the front. In the back of the front we have a one by two, two one by twos or you could just use a one by four, a one by six and I got two of these. I couldn't really find the colour again. I made this back in season five, but I didn't have like I didn't show it, so I wasn't such of a good builder back then. Then you got the steering wheel piece. So these make up the front. Moving on with the back platform. So at the bottom we have one of these one by two bricks with two Technic pins with studs on them. I have a one by two plate. I just used the paper method that I use for most of my customs. Um, I wrote ATK on there since that's the number plate on the ATKs. Not a rain cart. Gone. 
And got another one by two brick right here. Got two by three play right in there. We got a one by two one by sixes, one in blue, then one in grey. I think you could just use a um like a two by six, but I could I don't think I could find any at the time. So then we got a one by four right there. Then you have one of these, one by two, like, like, like a one by two, sort of like, but there with a the star in the end, like a space. I, I, I've never known the official name. And you got one of these clips, one by one clip with the, on the end. Then you got a pole, but there would actually be a thing sticking out here, but it broke off, so I used this one since. If I fit it in, it'll just look nice and smooth. You could just do, if you do have one that's like good, you could clip it on at the bottom, then use this bit and clip right on top. But I have a broken one, so I'm just flip it around. Then for here, we have a 2x2, two 2x3s, two, two by and also we got a hinge on here, on the like the brick hinge things, and I still don't know the official name, and a 2x4 flat tile. And that is the back plate. So with the back wheels, we have two of the 2x2 two two wheel attachment. Get the wheel off. It has like the little peg thingy bob. That. Yeah, you see that? I need to put the wheel back in. Fit that back on. So then this attaches got two by two to attach the two halves together. Since they're both symmetrical, except for the this one by two bar with the clip, use blue tack to attach on the pickaxe sign. So they're basically mirrored. So you got two one by um one by threes. On here, got two one by one studs. Right there, you got these two by two with the two by two plate attachment on the side. So these pieces, I have no idea what they're called. Then you got two one by two bars on the ends. Then you got the robot hands. They just clip on, and these make the railing to the back. And then for the final bit have the roof. So you have, this is again mirrored on the underneath, you got a missile, a flick fine missile, you got one of these clip bar attachments, you got a one by, one by two bar on the, on the end like before, you got a one by three, and grey, and then you have one of these anti poles with the anti stars at the bottom, then you get one of these um, Technic pins with the stud, so these can at at attach on, make the supports that lift up the roof, these attach on, but these go one so behind, so then the bars are like directly underneath, and then it looks like nice, and it's coming up into the roof to hold it up, so then it's not like coming out, and then that just sort of looks weird, so yeah. Moving on to putting all the bits together. So once you have all your bits, you want to get your back wheels. Flip this over so you get the one by two green and the two by two. This will just fit over and attach on. So then this lines up. Then if you wanted to, you could swap these out for a two by a two by three. But this is easier to when building it in chunks. And showing it in chunks to you guys. So then, with the two by two brick at the bottom, this will touch on the front four studs. This will break off. Touch this back on. Got two by two right there. And this will touch from here to give a smooth texture that it has. And for the back bit, has for the wheel covering that just protects the wheels. Got the steering wheel. So you've got like the seat starting to form here. Then with the back plate, this the forced anti-stud stand there. 
connects right in there. Let's fit right on top. There we go. And then finally, with the roof, we attach right on these the blue studs at the back. Once it's on, fold this down, point the flag at the back, then you got the ATK. Then I just use my icon minifig, take out the weapons, just sit them down, put them in here. You may need to take the roof off to just put it in a few figures. Then with beef, then I'll just take a beef boss, just quickly mold a burger. You can sit him down, but the passenger, actually, you can't, you can't fit him there. So you put him one stud across, then you can like droop the leg down, this leg. Or you can make it so it's like looking out from the side. Which is what most people do in the passenger, then they, they can just shoot enemies while driving by. And you got can just fit two up there, probably can fit three. So yeah. That is my 100 subscriber special. All the weapons, get K. And yeah, there's 100 pieces right there, one for every subscriber. And I'll see you all guys in the next video. Bye bye.